everybody, Alter Medicine here. Today I want to answer questions. I get all my emails all the time. Does the solar emit any EMF radiation? In this house, uh, you can see on the roof, this house is uh, fully solar operating. It has enough power to sustain its electricity needs and the solar has been installed around eight years ago. It works every day. I want to share with you, I want to do the measurement uh, if there's any EMF because of the solar system in the house. From my measurement, it's usually uh, always magnetic fields, increasing magnetic fields. Right now, here outside the house, we have like six nanotesla, three nanotesla, which is perfection, pure perfection, because we are here away from the city, in the village, away from big antennas, power lines, and uh, it's pure heaven. Like, I never seen such a low emission. The healthy, the healthy range of magnetic fields is under 30, it's under 20, it's still healthy. So 20, 30 nanotesla, it's still good. So outside, we're gonna go inside the house like just in a second. And right now I measured like four houses with solar panels. And in three houses, there was, the magnetic fields was okay. Uh, electric fields also. But in one house, the magnetic fields was highly elevated, like around 80 nanotesla. So I think it, it could depend on the company that you use to install or, the, or how they ground the wires and everything. Because this one, I tested it before and you're gonna see there's nothing. There's no increase, like four. We got four nanotesla. Six, a little bit, five still. We're gonna go inside the house. So we are really close here. Seven, there's nothing. There's nothing. A little bit increase. Just a tiny bit, but it's still healthy dose. Under 20 nanotesla, it's still healthy. So we go inside the house. We're gonna go around the house. Still seven, eight, yeah, a little bit. 20. But it could be electric wiring too, but it's still very healthy, very healthy. Seven, six. Here it increases a little bit. And we're reading 50 to 60 Hertz or under 2000, okay. 50 to 180 Hertz so I just wanted to record this it's it comes from the yeah magnetic fields comes usually from the power lines or some anomaly inside the house it doesn't come so much from electric wires <sighs> so my conclusion is let's switch to electric Let's switch to electric. You see? One. It's practically nothing. That is the conclusion. It's healthy to have the power line of the solar panels if you ground them correctly. So for my measurement, three out of four were okay and one was elevated. So that means something was wrong with that house because more I went up to the top floor, the higher magnetic fields I was really uh, I was getting. So I hope you're satisfied with this test. I wanted to test it on video. And that's my conclusion. You can have solar. Uh, but some people say that uh, 
there's a problem with stator there's a, with stator measurement with that dirty electricity but we don't measure that with gigahertz meters so that's another thing that's more a pseudo emf measurement where people install install those stator adapters and they feel worse than before so just avoid that uh the healthy emf met meter will will show you the real truth 